In this movie I will show how to remove only selected edges from any selection intent rule. Three different edge blend features will be created in this model. First, 0.5 mm radius will be created in the rectangular pocket. Here we will use the single edge option from the selection intent rule. After the edge blends are created, the geometry of the four corner holes will change. Chamfer will be added. The geometry is updated as expected. Now, create a 1mm radius on the side pockets. Let's use the tangent edges option. The rest of the model should have 2 mm radius on all edges except the holes. To do this, set the selection intent rule to body edges. To deselect an edge, hold the shift key on your keyboard and select the edge you want to remove. The removed edge was created using the body edges rule, so the same rule is applied when removing the edge. As a result, all edges are removed. Create again the edge blend geometry with the body edges rule. To remove the edge, hold the shift key, place the cursor over the edge and wait for the quick pick. Click with left mouse button and select the appropriate edge in the quick pick dialog box. You can repeat the procedure on other edges. The edge blend was also created over the chamfer geometry, which is not correct. Again, you can deselect edges using quick pick. But as we have already seen, this will take too much time. There is a faster way to deselect edges. Hold the shift key again. Now, Hold down the left mouse button and fence select the edges you want to deselect. Only the selected edges will be removed from the body edges rule and there is no need for quick pick selection. Now add some chamfers to the next holes. An error message appears with the edge blend feature after the change. NX tries to create blend geometry on the chamfers, but this causes the blends to overlap. Edit the edge blend feature. Just fence select the edges of the holes to be removed from the edge blend feature, as we did earlier. Threaded holes should also be removed from this edge blend feature. This is a pretty simple example, but I hope this option helps you remove edges on more complex geometry. If you stayed with me until the end, please subscribe, like, or leave a comment and, have a nice day.